welcome, welcome back to the ranch. We're going to continue on our journey through Paleo Pines today. It's so much fun. It's such a cute little game. This game is available on Steam, and that's where I'm playing it from. But I believe you can also get it on Switch and uh, PlayStation, Xbox, and just about everywhere. I will double check that information, but I'm pretty sure you can get it just about everywhere. Uh, thanks for tuning in, and without further ado, let's get going in Paleo Pines. Uh, we are on uh, Triassia. Uh, day 14, or Sunday the 14th. Let's run and check our garden real quick and we do have things to harvest now you can harvest uh, I've been staying away from the controls a bit because this is available on different platforms but there's several ways you can harvest on PC for sure you can left click which I did there or you can hit the E button E button to harvest on PC uh, just so that you guys know, I'm going to get my bag here. I hit I for inventory and I'm going to grab out my hoe and I'm going to go hoe in my garden. <laughs> Takes a little bit of stamina, but we got this. Uh, today, I think we're going to expand the garden a bit. Um, those were potatoes. Let's grab some more potato seeds because I'm pretty sure we have some. Yes, we do. And let's put them back out the same way we took them in. We're not going to water because we have a dino that can do that. So we will get the dino to water the garden for us. Like I say, we may actually expand the garden a bit today. Don't know. Let's find out. We do have quite a bit of things to do today. Alright. Let's go run grab this dino. We'll clean out the dino pen because it looks like they're upset about something. Let's see how much food. Oh, they're running low on food. Now, I saw a gentleman online. I was watching other channels and seeing what they're doing on, uh, on Paleo Pines. And this one gentleman said, don't buy food. Well, when you get multiple dinos like we have, you kind of got to buy a bit of food. Uh, so we may be buying food today, which is against the recommendation of another YouTuber. But <laughs> I, I love the dinos and I would love to be able to get more. Meaning we got to be able to feed all these guys and girls. So. And yes, you can pick up food along the way in your journeys. But it just doesn't seem to be enough. They, they're they hungry. Hungry little boogers, I tell ya. <laughs> so, let's see. You gonna spray the garden. Get it all done. There we go. Very cool. Very cool. All right. Everybody seems to be very happy. Let's check our journal and see what we need. We need 10 potatoes, 15 onions, and 20 carrots for gummy. We need 25 potatoes for Pippin. We could probably do that. 10 fiber, 10 stone. All right. Uh, 
Let's get our whistle out. Alright. Ugh, why can I not yoo-hoo this guy today? There we go. Wait here. Alright. We're going to get rid of this. We're going to go get stone and stone and wood, I believe it was. Oops. Double check. Double check. Fiber and stone. Okay, fiber and stone. Potatoes. We put the bulk of those back anyway. Uh, fiber. That's fiber. Potatoes. Carrots. Onions. Carrots. Onions. Double check. Fiber stone, potatoes, potatoes, 15 spring onions. Oh my goodness. Okay. That's 14. All right. We got those. Uh, let's see. Can take those to Granny. We can get a lot of quests knocked out. Let's see if we have garlic. I don't think we do. It doesn't look like we have any garlic. That's okay. We can probably get some. Let's go turn in these quests. Come on, little buddy. <laughs> Off we go. We will look around the valley and see if we can find some more herbivore food laying around. But, like I say, with even three dinos, I'm not real sure that the, what we can find is going to be enough. There's some pears that we can pick up. There's different ones today. I haven't seen that little uh, peachy colored one. Isn't it cute? Okay. We'll see if Granny's at work today. Yes, Granny's at work. Awesome. Well, well, look what the rap dragged in. Anything you need? Let's chat. So how do you go in on those vegetables for me? I got them. I like the way you work it. Hot diggity. <laughs> Why don't you bag them up? Hold your hadasars. We're not done yet. Ever learn to cook? No. You mean, you've been eating raw potatoes and uncooked onions since you moved in? Ew. Love a lumberjack. Cooking's the best part about growing your own veg. Buckle up, buttercup, because it's going to be learning time. Okay, so. You've surely seen the cooking products to Owen's Lake. Take these ingredients I wrestled up and head on over there. 
I took the liberty of sticking the recipe in your journal while you weren't looking. The best thing about classic stew is that it's almost impossible to get wrong. It's a good starter recipe. You'll learn others, but you'll learn you'll never learn better. Now hop to it. All right. Oops. Granny wants to talk to us again. Well, paint me purple and call me a beetroot. What do you need? Let's chat. Hey there, DC. What you got there? First of all, I told you I didn't need any help. Second of all, how am I supposed to get all these home? I'm only half a human high, and most of it's hair. Here, take them back with you. No good to me here. They'll just clutter my stall. Okay, Granny. Anything else? No? Okay. Let's check. This person needs three fiber, which Granny just gave us all our fiber back, so... Orlin, we need to buy some herbivore food. Thank you. All right. We got some herbivore food. Hiya, DC. Are you here for a poppin' or two? Popping anyone. Hey, did you get your hands on those 25 potatoes I needed? Yep. Thank you so much. You're a lifesaver. Next time I see you, I will return the favor. All right. Let's look at our inventory. We got three earthy poppins because we just ordered that from him. All right. Let's look at our journal again. Still need to find garlic. Oh, we gotta bring those supplies to Granny at home. So we gotta wait till this afternoon or this evening to do that. That's fine. That's fine. These little characters in this game are so cute. So very cute. All right, so let's go to, oh, I almost want to grab this little guy. He's so cute. Blue, yellow, purple. So it'd be three. Okay. Oh my goodness, what? I almost put you to sleep, bud. Let's try you on a carrot. See what you think. We probably have the wrong kind of poppin'. Oh, that worked? How about another carrot? Okay, that worked. Um, ooh, it's right on the line. One more carrot. It might put it to the other side of the line. Yep. Oh, let's try it. He's probably going to go, no, I don't want an earthy poppin'. 
No! I'm sorry. Run away. Aww. Bye. We will bring you back a different poppin' because, oh my goodness, you are so cute. Bring you back a different kind of poppin'. But, in the meantime, we need to go up towards Owen's. And cook. There's Owen's place right down there. The cooking pot is over here. Yes. Yes. All right, let's see. To make classic stew, first choose the soup category. Soup. To cook any type of soup, you need a stone and wood for the fire. You can see how much you need on the left. Come back when you have enough. Okay. That's fine. We will come back when we have some more wood. Kind of wish it would have told us that before we got here, but that's okay. So, let's get a different kind of poppin'. Let's get some wood. Tell our dino to wait because we don't want it running off while we're digging in here. Okay. I'm gonna put those onions up. I'm gonna grab some wood. And I'm gonna grab a different kind of couple of different kind of poppins. Oops. Grab some food for the dinos too. You wait there, but no, actually, come on. You run faster than I do. Yes, I have food for you guys. Hold on. There we go. There we go. Now, come back. those back up. Let's go see if we can seduce this little dino. Because he's so cute. Right, we got its attention. There we go. Okay, you're curious. Let's give you a carrot. Seemed to work. We're going to feed a lot of carrots doing this way, but we know it kind of works. Okay. 
let's go one more. Plop. Shoot a little bit. Oh no. <laughs> Feed a uh, potato, maybe? We want you in the green. You're kind of in the green. Just uh, try a crunchy poppin'. What do you think? Oh, you did not like that. Okay. Um, feed you another carrot. <laughs> she didn't like the crunchy poppin', and I think that's all I got. Let's see. Um, oh, we got a fragrant poppin' too. Okay, we'll try the fragrant one. Good thing we brought 91 carrots. Fragrant poppin'? It almost it it almost goes with your color scheme. Come on, buddy. No? Ooh, don't like that at all, do ya? Okay, at least you didn't say absolutely no to the crunchy poppin. Okay, we'll come back. Crunchy poppin was not an absolute no. Alright, let's try this soup thing again. Alright, to make classic stew, choose the soup category. Until you master the stew, you must experiment with the correct flourishes. Okay, experiment. Okay, let's do a potato. A carrot. And a glib. Okay. Fifteen spring onions. I didn't bring enough. <laughs> oh my gosh. I did not bring enough. Okay, <laughs> confirm back. I didn't bring enough onions, so oh no. <laughs> oh gosh, this is crazy. Back home again. Hey, where are you going? <laughs> so, that dino liked the crunchy poppin'. So we're gonna put those back up. That dino liked carrots. have enough stuff. Fifteen. 
We may not have enough potatoes now. Who knows? Who knows? Just go make this silly soup. Goodness gracious sakes alive. All right. So, to make classic stew, chose the soup category. You must experiment. <clears throat> okay. Add 10 potatoes. Confirm. 15 spring onions. That's 14. That's 15. All right. Now add 20 carrots. Hook. Wait for it. Wait for it. Now. Yay, we got a classic stew. Thank you. Success! You've mastered that recipe. You can cook it again at any time or keep experimenting to find new recipes. Okay. Sweet. Is Pat thankful? Let's check our bag. We've got those. We've got those. Let's go see if we can catch this little fart knocker. Yes, I said fart knocker. He's so cute. We got the friend call down. He's excited to see us this time. Maybe he's tired of us playing with him. Oh, my goodness. Oh my goodness, it's going to work this time. It's going to work this time. <gasps> yes! Oh my gosh, what are we going to name this guy? Pasitacosaurus. Um, boy. Just name him Deary. <laughs> I got no idea. I have no idea. Hi, Deary. You're very cute. Alright, let's go back home. I can't believe we got him that time. How fast are you? You're pretty fast. So... <clears throat> We need to... We're going to hop off of him. We can let him just go back to the pen. I'm going to put all this stuff back up again. I'm going to get out our flute. Uh-oh. No. I'm going to get out a small dream stone. Now I'm going to get off our flute. Tell it to follow me. Yeah. 
And we're gonna go in the dino pen. Come on, buddy. There you go, little buddy. All right, this is your home. Enjoy. We're gonna put out a dream stone for this little dude. Right there. Now, we need to... What do we need to do? Oh, upgrade! We need to upgrade the Dream Stone. So we're going to come out here and go to our storage. We have one here. We're going to need a few things. We should double check what we need. I know it's wood. Wood, fiber, dandelion, and clover. So we're going to add the wood. We're going to add the fiber. We need dandelion and clover to upgrade this dream stone to a sleeping patch. Dandelion and clover. Let's run back over here. And we will do the dandelion and the clover and click build. There's a little sleeping patch for a little dino. And we just double check that by going here and Smasher's happy, Deary's happy, Lucky's happy, and Thankful is happy. Everybody's happy. They have a pen. They have food. Their pen is clean. And they have a dreamstone that is capable of giving them a place to sleep. Very cool. Very cool. So that's upgrading a dreamstone. It works the exact same way for the big dreamstones as well. Maybe not the same ingredients all the time, but you get the picture. So let's go back here. Let's put all this stuff back in storage that we don't need right this minute. Let's grab out our stuff for tomorrow. Our inventory is getting a bit unruly. Just a bit. Um, why can I not find what I'm looking for? There it is. All right. Let's see. We need to bring the stew to Granny. We need to have 10 stone and bring those to Granny at home. Stone. Let's find our stew. I think we're not going to wait until tomorrow. We're going to go to Granny now because she might be at home by now. So. Alright. Oh, you're almost out of stamina, so I'm not going to take you. Let's take Lucky. Come here, Lucky.
Let's go take Lucky to Granny's house. We're gonna stop by here and make sure Granny's not still at work. I don't think she will be. No, she's not. Good. Okay. Let's go to Granny's house. I'm gonna run myself out of stamina. All this running around. Alright, Lucky. Lego. There was some food there. We need to observe one of these guys sleeping as well. Lucky leveled up. Let's go to Granny's house. Off we go to Granny's house. Hey, Granny. Oh, looky here. One portion of classic stew. Now you know the basics. Don't be afraid to experiment from time to time. Sure, you may end up with some catastrophes, but no harm in trying new things. Here, take another recipe. A little tip from me to you. Everyone loves a fresh cooked meal on their budding day. Good tip. Anyway, I should be getting this over to Mari. She loves it when I cook for her. Okay. No, I don't want to pet Willem and Squillem. But, yeah. Um, let's talk to Granny again. Willem, Squillem, cut it out. You're meant to be in charge of repairs. Repairs? Okay. Unless... Useless, the both of you. Why do I even... Oh, hi, DC. Are those my supplies? About time, too. I've got a list so long I can't even lift it. Here. I'm trying to clear out some of my old junk out of this house. How'd you like this beauty? Ooh, a lantern. Right. I need a chaperone. I need to go chaperone Willem and Squillem. Silly beakies can't even... Fix a storage shed on their own. Very cool. All right. We got a big lantern. Yay. All right. Very, very cool. We're going to look around here for a minute on our way out the door. That's why I'm not going so fast. See if there was anything we can pick up. I have a feeling that garlic is going to be found over there near Granny's. Mm. So I need to observe one of these guys asleep. So let's see if we can put one of these guys to sleep. What do we have? What do we have? We don't have anything. All right. Easy peasy. We don't have to feed them to put them to sleep. We just soothe them till they get bored. Uh, thought it was one of those that we had to. Study a wild gallim 
hypnosis while it's asleep. Okay, that's what we're doing. Um... It's asleep. Um, <laughs> I don't know. It's not asleep anymore. Okay. Um, um, okay. Try this one. Um, what is not going on here? I don't know. Can't take any notes, but look, there's a large dreamstone over here. So this kind of did pay off after all. All right, Lucky, let's go back home. It's getting late. It's getting late. All right. We're going to use Lucky before we put Lucky up. We're going to use Lucky to clear out some more of this stuff. Because every time we get a chance, we need to be clearing this area so that we can expand. There's a debris we can get rid of. Can't get rid of that one. It's too far away. There's one there. Tired, huh? Okay. You're fine. Thank you, Lucky. Head bop. All right, you, come here. Get you to get rid of some of these rocks. Smash. Smash. go. Alright, Smasher leveled up. Look at that. Alright, Smasher. Time for you to go back to bed, too, I think. Yeah. You're like, I'm too tired. Too tired. Alright, give you a pet pat. Head bop. Give you a pet pat. Little dearie. Alright. 
All right. Everybody's tired. I'm tired. Let's go to bed. Oh. And thank you all so much for watching. We will continue this journey next time when we view Paleo Pines with the ranch. If you like content like this, if you like cozy games, give this video a like. And also, consider subscribing to the channel. It doesn't cost you a penny. Uh, and it is greatly appreciated to my subscribers and to everyone that's watching right now. Thank you so much for tuning in. I will be back with more Paleo Pines content, plus lots more content from other cozy games. Thank you so much. As always, love ya. Bye.